Hi EP Kids, I'm coming to you today from my craft room. Crafting is something that I love to do when I'm not at church and when I have a few spare minutes. And I'm guessing there's a few of you out there at least that enjoy crafting. So feel free to drop me a note and let me know what kind of crafts you like to do. This week we're going to be talking about the idea of grace. Now grace is a big word, but I think the best way I can describe it is that grace is getting something good that you don't deserve. And we're going to be exploring this idea in three different videos um, this weekend. So let's get started with this one. Jesus last week was having dinner with his disciples. Well, this week he's actually on the cross. He has been taken out and put on the cross. And on either side of Jesus, there were two other, there was a guy on either side that was also crucified. Now, Jesus had never done anything wrong in his whole life. He did not deserve to be on that cross. These guys, on the other hand, had done quite a few wrong things that broke their relationship with God. Um, this glass is going to represent one of the thieves, and it's got some nice, clean, clear water in it. I could, I can drink it. Um, actually, it came out of the bathroom sink, so I might not. But I could drink it. It's clean, and it's fresh. And here I have a chemical. And you know what? One drop of this chemical definitely makes it so I can't drink this water. And that's kind of what happens to our relationship with God when we do wrong things. All of a sudden, just one wrong thing breaks the relationship with God. And you know what? I personally haven't just done one wrong thing in my life, and certainly not even this week. This week, I yelled at my kids a couple times. I know, not good. Um, I was kind of selfish about some things and wanted things to go my way. Um, I kind of got annoyed with a few people and that without Jesus is what I would look like inside. And that's what this thief looked in, like inside. His friend over here, same problem. Because you know what? That's all of us. All of us have done wrong things. But as they were hanging there on the cross, this thief over here started making fun of Jesus. And he was saying things like, get yourself down off that cross and take me with you, basically. And he was just not being nice. And he certainly wasn't acknowledging that Jesus was God at all or asking God to forgive him. This thief, however, said, you know what? I really do think that Jesus is who he says he is, that he's really God and that he really is here to forgive people's sins. And he actually asked Jesus to forgive him. And he asked Jesus to remember him when Jesus was in paradise. Now, paradise is another big word. And in this case, it doesn't mean Hawaii or Florida or some tropical destination. It means heaven. So he was saying, Jesus, when you go to heaven, remember me. And Jesus said, oh, no, I forgive you. And today you're going to get to be with me in heaven. And when Jesus forgave him, the man's sins were gone. That is grace. This man did not deserve to be forgiven. He didn't do anything to earn it. He didn't go out and tell people about Jesus. He didn't go do a whole bunch of good deeds. He didn't stop stealing. He didn't any of those things because he died not very long after this. Uh, like, you know, very, very soon he was on a cross. So this guy received grace. And when we ask Jesus to forgive our sins, we receive that same grace. And that allows us to have a relationship with God and to walk with him. Now this guy over here, he made a different choice, didn't he? He made a choice to make fun of God. He made a choice to not ask God to forgive him. And by making the choice to not ask God to forgive him, he was making a choice to stay with that sin in his life. And I'm really happy for this thief because this thief got to experience that gift that God gives us of forgiveness. And I hope that when you watch the next video or two, you'll get a better understanding of what grace is. And maybe you'll make the decision to ask God to forgive you too. All right, I will see you on the next video.